Clearly a lot to discuss um, within this hearing. What do you want the public to know or to gather from this hearing? Well, I've been tasked by Jim Jordan and the Judiciary Committee to expand on exactly how much uh, non-compliance there has been by this administration with our demands. You know, we are an equal branch of government with the executive branch. Uh, when we have demands for documents, they must provide them. We have had subpoenas go out from the Judiciary Committee time and time again. And by combining the FBI, the Department of State, and the FTC, uh, we're going to be showing the American people just how broad uh, this obstruction has been by this administration. You know, our viewers are very familiar with some of the stories that you mentioned. You know, what was going on behind the scenes at Twitter when Elon Musk wasn't in charge? Why was the FBI targeting parents who went to school board meetings? I mean, these are, these are, peop these are just storylines that the American public has questions about. How is this able to happen at such a high level of government here? Will you be able to find out those answers later this week? Well, we are going to find out as much as we can, and what we can't find out, uh, we're going to be holding those agencies accountable. You know, we have broad Article I powers, uh, so the investigation of this administration is ongoing. We have taken additional steps with an impeachment inquiry, uh, but what we've seen is this administration launch a weaponization program across government using social media beginning from the very early days of this administration, uh, if not earlier, uh, in talking between the administration and their supporters and the press and uh, social media and putting pressure to adhere to their line of a story, whether it's COVID, whether it's the Biden family, whether whether it's Twitter, you name it, uh, this administration has a position and they want you to follow their line of uh, the facts or the lack thereof, uh, even if the facts prove them wrong. And so we're going to be focusing back on uh, essentially the, the biases of this administration, um, the weaponization of government, and the collusion between the press, big tech, and this administration uh, dating back to its very beginning. As some would call the narrative, right, putting that forth. I wanted to close on this if, if we can. I'm sure you've heard this breaking news. The president's son, Hunter Biden, has agreed to testify, but he wants to do it publicly in front of the House Oversight Committee and, and, and uh, Chairman Comer. The chairman responded basically saying, hey, you, we can do that at a later date, but we'd like to do the closed door deposition in December. But it goes back to your overall point of, of compliance. Um, and now there's negotiation over how uh, you would receive testimony, how you respond to subpoenas. Um, Congressman Klein, can you respond to this news here? Again, um, Hunter Biden's attorney wanting to do this publicly. Uh, again, the chairman of this committee, the oversight committee saying, no, let's do this like the subpoena says, like the procedure says behind closed doors, and then we can potentially do it publicly. Do you have a comment for that, Congressman? Well, this committee is trying to get the facts, get to the bottom of the corruption that was going on in the Biden family uh, between Hunter Biden and the rest of the family and exactly follow the money to where it leads. And they're preparing a report to give to the Judiciary Committee. The Democrats are stalling. They've essentially sent uh, the message to Hunter Biden that we will protect you if it's in public and for show. Uh, you won't have to give any facts, you won't have to give any information as you would in a deposition, uh, because in a deposition it takes hours and hours and hours. Uh, you ask the, the little questions that won't be kind of interfered with uh, by uh, counsel for the other side, by members from the other side who just want to play for the cameras. So that's what this is all about. It's about blocking, continuing to block uh, Chairman Comer and this House of Representatives from finding out the facts for the American people. That is Congressman Ben Klein joining us from the Capitol. Congressman, thank you for that. Thank you.